गौतम जी बहुत बहुत स्वागत है कोई थैंक यू थैंक यू फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल कॉन्ग्रेचुलेशन फॉर द फर्स्ट मूवी थैंक यू हाउ मच एक्साइटेड वेरी मच ऑब्वियसली द फर्स्ट मूवी एंड इट्स इट मीन्स बिग थिंग लाइक इट्स लाइक फर्स्ट चाइल्ड सो यह अमेजिंग इट हैज़ बिन अ जर्नी ऑफ फाइव ईयर्स सो नाउ आई एम लुकिंग फॉरवर्ड फॉर इट्स रिलीज सो द स्टोरी ऑफ गाँव इज इंस्पायर्ड बाई माई ओन विलेज इन झारखंड एंड Uh, when i was a child my village was cut off from rest of the world so we had a community based society and uh, uh, money was almost not there so everybody depended on each other uh, for everything so uh, we had some sort of system like uh, entire village will gather three times a day for meal uh, also if you are making cloth you are making for entire village if you are do- doing agriculture you are doing for uh, entire village so it was community based there was no st- sort of position but then uh, government reached road reached system reached and uh, things started changing uh, so called development reached uh, i came out of that village uh, uh, my father sent me to study in hostel and then then i was able to watch the changes uh, from outside and uh, uh, now when i see people call themselves so called developed they have got all the uh, new technologies tv phone and all those things uh, pakka makan but kuch jo hai missing hota chala gaya the gaon tells the story of those missing element so it is basically my own uh, story and uh, i wanted to capture it i am a documentary filmmaker i couldn't cap- capture it while it was happening so i had to fictionalize it and then i uh, made this film after the aljazeera was started before that aljazeera or after that and what did the father seen the trailer what was how the like his reaction and what he said See, uh, uh, for in Al Jazeera, I've been working as a documentary filmmaker for almost uh, uh, 15 to 16 years now. Uh, I've been making documentaries, basically. Uh, this one uh, now, I wanted to do something. I wanted to do uh, a feature film, uh, and uh, so uh, Al Jazeera was quite supportive. Al Jazeera, in fact, followed me and my crew and did a documentary out of this film. while we were shooting for this film uh, and uh, my parents and everybody is quite villagers are quite looking forward to this film this film will also be releasing near my village so all of them will go and uh, watch the film there uh, in a way basically my i have been filmmaker for quite some time but my villagers never considered me filmmaker you know because uh, uh, my films don't play in nearest in cinema hall so uh, perhaps this time they will be able to see my name in theater and start started uh, considering me as a filmmaker so this is like a uh, uh, journey completing sort of thing so is it planning to promote your like movie in your village or something is that yes uh, uh, i'm going there tomorrow okay. and a uh, uh, lot of people are supporting locally charkhand government is supporting uh, quite a lot uh, Jharkhand Jharkhand government has put a lot of their own uh, public relation department officials to promote this movie because this is movie of uh, this movie lot of many people connect to this is not a story of one village basically i'm sorry i'm just uh, uh, digressing from what you asked but this is a story of uh, every village on this planet basically we are we are getting heading towards a monotonous society where everything will look same uh, uh, in the name of smart cities we are turning our villages into disaster see villages are basically known for its unique qualities uh, for peace harmony spirituality ayurveda agriculture those kind of thing and we need to support them for their these quality well what we are doing uh, in the name of smart cities and development we are going there mining their land displacing them Uh, putting a factory is uh, putting out pollution polluting the place and uh, saying that now you are developed so 
what are we doing basically uh, uh, recently you must have seen a lot of uh, 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 unwanted uh, uh, news coming out from villages of like mob lynching yeah. writing rapes all these were unheard of 20 years ago you didn't hear these kind of events from villages these are city crimes yeah. and uh, now because uh, uh, we are going there with city ideas and uh, uh, the villagers are confused and they are trying to do city things without knowing the consequences so uh, we are basically heading to a disaster and for uh, uh, these times, this sort of movie is very important. Having said all this, uh, this is not a dark film. It's full of comedy, and people uh, uh, will uh, die laughing in theater. Uh, only when they come out, uh, the message will start sinking in. Personally, what kind of cinema you like? So you, the, like you personally feel that this is the cinema which I'm looking for. Obviously, uh, Every art must have a meaning, otherwise there is no meaning of art. Uh, uh, any film with some meaning, some message, something in it uh, uh, is always I will go for. Uh, but unfortunately, 99.99% uh, .99 films uh, have no, uh, no meaning. There is no story. There is, there is one star and there is one all those masalas right. basically and uh, uh, that's sad that's sad for this art form but do you think it's now it's very much changing we're seeing the content in movies are coming and not be as like very much yeah. and uh, that's why i'm encouraged to make the film like uh, 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 things have changed people now the people in industry have also started realizing that uh, these kind of contents are liked by the people. Cannot make a fool people. Yeah, exactly, yeah. exactly. These these are the contents which are working today in yeah. the market. Uh, rest all are plum plumbing, uh, and uh, uh, this is what the future is. People uh, now with the opening up of media and exposure and everything, people are getting to know new contents every day, and obviously, uh, the IQ wise, the regular. Cinema goers, IQ wise, uh, they like this kind of con inte uh, intelligent content, right. not the mindless comedy. As you said, the Jharkhand government also supporting this movie. Yeah. The, uh, the Jharkhand government has to like, make this tax, tax free for that city for uh, that movie. I hope so. Uh, uh, I mean, Jharkhand government has gone out uh, and extended their hand in every. Uh, think possible to make this movie happen yeah. right from the shooting till now uh, there is uh, earlier you had entertainment tax separately but I think with GST now it's not under a state government to excuse a film or uh, it, it's all uh, get controlled by the center uh, I did raise this question to Jharkhand government and that's what the reply I had got yeah. Recently, there has been many. In fact, uh, uh, I I got uh, Raji. Yeah. They recently came, which was quite good. Uh, Newton was quite good. Uh, uh, even Village Rock Star. I'm uh, I'm very happy for Rima. I mean, uh, we know each other for quite some time. Uh, uh, the kind of film she made, uh, taking the real character and making this movie. This is amazing. Uh, uh, these kind of cinema will keep our hope alive. Uh, where almost with no investments he managed to make, make the film. So I'm very proud of these films. Yeah, the, in recent time, uh, I have been following Vishal Bharadwaj quite a lot. Uh, I mean, he's, uh, the way he tells the story is quite unique uh, in a musical way. Uh, otherwise, uh, I am from film school, so yeah. there you have uh, Gurudat, uh, Sham Banakal, Satyajit Ray, Trufo, Godar, and all uh, all those content basically I have grown up watching. So there are a lot of favorites, but in recent times uh, from Bollywood it will be Vishal Bharadwaj. Last year, I was in the US. 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 I was in the US.
बहुत ही इंटरटेनमेंट से भरा हुआ फिल्म है आप आएँ बहुत ही मज़ेदार फिल्म है और बेसिकली आप हंसते हंसते लोट पोट हो जाएंगे और जब बाहर आएंगे तो दो मिनट के लिए फिर रुक कर सोचेंगे कि हम किस ये अंधी दौड़ में भागे जा रहे हैं और ये सोचने पे मजबूर करेगी आशा है आप इस फिल्म को देखेंगे थैंक यू सो मच थैंक यू